Hmm? It's a noni. Who is it? Yeah. This is not the noni. This is yeah. Claire. Yeah. Hi guys, welcome to my channel and thank you so much for being here. Welcome. It's not the noni. It's not the non. It's okay, let's look at the noni downstairs. Hi guys, welcome. Oh my god. <laughs> Are you done? No. Both of you? No. Hi guys. Welcome to my channel and thank you so much for being here. Welcome to a weekend vlog. We are starting this vlog on Hi, Thursday. Yeah. Hi vlog. We're starting this vlog on Thursday, the public holiday. Um, because I've got things to do. I want to have a braai, a little braai for the kids. But I'm hungover. I'm so hungover. Your girl went out last night with her homegirls. I had so much fun. I was home by midnight, but I'm here. I'm hanging, Hello. hanging, and imagine we ha we had to shoot. Hello. Guys, I'm part of this Mother's Day campaign by Claire. Vision board, hello, guys. Did I tell you? Like, if you go back and watch my vision board video, you will know that I said that I would like to work with brands, especially for Mother's Day, because I'm a mother. Hello. <laughs> so, I, and I did. So, I, my kids and I are working on this campaign with Claire. It's a very weird and confusing campaign. Um, we tried our best, so now I'm just gonna have to edit that and send it to them. Milano was not in the mood. I'm hungover. Alwanda was the only person who was cooperative, but we'll see. Hopefully, it turns out fine. Hopefully, we don't have to reshoot because you know one thing about me, I hate it when brands come back and say reshoot. So we were we're done shooting that, and on the same breath, I have to say I'm really really grateful that my vision board is literally coming to life. It's very beautiful to see. When I started taking vision board seriously, it was last year. And best decision I ever did last year. I think probably 70 to 75 percent of the things on my vision board came to life. And this year, we are let's say we are 20 percent in. You know what, guys? Let me go do this intro downstairs because clearly, this is not my room, this is not my bed, and this is not, not my, my channel. It's just let me go I'm back here. to tell you about my weekend plans. I don't know them yet. But let me just talk about today. Um, last night I went out with my friends. We got sloshed and now I'm hungover. And the only thing that cures the hangover is meat. So I want to have a braai, but we have no meat. We only have vors in this house. I want to have a braai. Um, I've invited like two friends who live, who live close by. And But the braai is supposed to be just me and my children. But I just figured ugh, my kids don't eat that much meat anyway. I, I'm going to, I'm starving. Alan is dishing for me now. And after eating, I am going to go outside to go buy to go buy a few things for the bride. If only you could see me now. If only you could tell me why you disappeared. You made me cry. Nothing in peace. My turn. It's not your turn. Your turn to do what? Move. I have two packages that I want to open with you guys. This? But like, I want to open. I want so, to open the door. Right okay. The yeah, this one is from Beauty on Tap. What the e have? I literally ordered one thing. My lotion. Guys, Beauty on Tap, name. I ordered this. It was probably half past eight. Sorry. Um, it was probably half past eight in the morning. It was half past eight in the morning when I opened uh, when I ordered this and it I got I got it at four yesterday in the same day, you guys. They are expensive but they're worth it. So we're gonna need a scissors. Literally when I say bane haba guys, I mean the, 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 the notes. Um literally it's one thing. It's this lotion that I use. That's all. But the box is so huge. It's literally this pastry um lotion. It's really, really good for dry skin, especially now in winter. I started using it late last year. It was summer and it's been amazing on my skin. It is expensive. I think it's like $2.50. But okay, it does its job. Nah. 
So this is my favorite um, parcel I received yesterday. So this is from Otandazo. She um, started a brand, Yamaduku Imwazo. Um, she started this line, I think, two, three years ago. I'm not sure. BRP, guys, let me calm her down. You guys, I just unboxed this and I did like a, a shot, a reel for Instagram. I'm going to edit it now. And when I opened it, the shock, the shock of my life when I opened this package, I thought she was going to send me a mazo water. She sent me one, two, three, four, five. I'll show you guys now. Um, but I just want to give you a background on Utandazo. So as I was mentioned, I met Utandazo at an industry event a couple of years ago. And we kept in touch via, we exchanged Instagram handles. And only to find about, we have a lot of mutual, common friends, mutual friends. And we've just been in touch since. So not so long ago, and I know that she launched this line. I, I want to say she launched this line before the pandemic. She launched this line of of very stylish dogs, but very, like stylish, but still like I don't know how to explain it. Stylish and still traditional. So today's Thursday. Priscilla supposed to be here, but I was just like, girl, it's fine. Take the day off. It's a public holiday. Be with your family. Um. So the material out of this world. I think so far, this is my favorite because. Okay, let me see if I can. Oh yeah, so I'm still explaining, like her dukes are stylish, but also quite, they still have that traditional element in it. It's also, mine. Utandazo has a YouTube channel. Mine. I will link her channel. Can I put it on first? I will link her channel. See, I like this one because like you guys know I like these. Well, Mama, if you, you want this one. Mm -hmm. Okay. If you're not new to this channel, you know that I like to wear my wig and put a duke on. But Milani says she wants this one. So, I must take this one. This one is so, the material, it's giving, I'm going to a wedding. It's giving rich. She's got a YouTube channel where she does these um, tutorials on how to tie imwazo. Yeah, okay. I will link her channel before below. I will also link her Instagram, uh, her business handle, Instagram handle. Look at her, uh, the, the tag. But this one, it's oh, it's royal blue and it's giving. I need to watch her. She's orange. I need to watch her channel so I can, cause now I only know how to tie a duck like this. <laughs> this is it. No, you know what? I feel like this lighting is not giving it. Let's go upstairs. Let's go do this upstairs. Take that duck. Let's go upstairs. The lighting is more or less the same, but I wanted. Um, I felt like downstairs the lighting wasn't doing any justice to, to the ducks. So I will link um, Tandazo's channel below where she does these tutorials. I'll also link her business, her Instagram handle um, for her business. So if you guys are interested, this is my favorite. The color, the color, the material, everything screams regal, rich bitch. And I feel like also with her dogs, the one of this one. I mean, I guess this one is like straightforward. But guys, I, mean, like, I only know how to tie my dogs like this. Um, but there is like, a, as mentioned, she does have a, a what is this thing a channel where she does these tutorial i think this one you can also do something like apple i used to be such a duke girl back in the days before them wigs oh, this one this one shate shatani shatani this one i think i would also give it this shatani bo shatani okay and I said the other royal, the no, regal one. one. Okay, no, no. So let me shut the guys. Because I'm ready. I'm ready. Okay, this one's my favorite. This one's my absolute, absolute favorite. Listen, listen. Oh my god, to go it. Songs at your wedding. Hey, 
I, I feel like I'm the mother of the bride. I feel like I'm the older sister of the bride. I know this one. I'm going to keep this one for the rest. Of, okay, I can't keep this one for the rest of the day. Because I'm obsessed with these dogs. Um, thank you so much, Tandazo. And for her to actually even reach out and say, she actually reached out a couple of weeks ago, but you guys know me. I don't know how to take kind, know how to take kindness well. Like when people reach out to me offering kindness, I'm always just like, so what I do, I just ignore. But she was just like, girl, you ain't gonna ignore me. You're not gonna ignore me. And I'm so glad that she, she, she did, she did that. In attack. I'm so glad that she reached out and she sent me a message. The message she sent me, a voice note even and i could even hear it in her voice it was so genuine just basically telling me how proud of how, how proud she is of me she was basically telling me how proud she is of me she was saying that my through my videos she's she now looks at her mother differently she was raised by a single mom through my videos she understands why her mom did some of the things that she did she did some of the decisions that she made and i that touched my heart I know a lot of you guys watch my channel, you don't have children, you don't have deadbeats, um, but some of you will actually say that as much as I'm not a mother, watching your channel makes me understand my mother better, um, who was a single mother. So I'm glad that I started this channel to talk, to to be like a advocate for single mothers, but I actually didn't realize, Uguti, I thought that only single mothers would be watching my channel. I actually didn't realize that people who were raised by single mothers would also resonate with my with me and also not only that only that the fact that you guys can come here and say that you know through this channel through watching me go through the things that i go through with my single parenthood journey it makes you look at your mom differently and makes you appreciate her more or whatever that warms my heart because our abo mabe to that generation um never had space to talk they never had space to open up and share their feelings so i can imagine how hard it must have been for them to be single mothers but you can't shame your deadbeat you can't talk about it there's nobody to talk to um the more you, if you talk society i mean even the man i still get shamed by society for talking i still have people here on this channel telling me to stop talking about my deadbeats and in this day and age people still find it they still feel comfortable to tell me to stop talking about my pain and my struggles with these men. I can't now imagine what our parents went through. And unfortunately, the difference between our generation and that generation is that we are at least very self-aware. Our parents they were dealing with a lot and some of the decisions that they made may have negatively affected you and negatively, negatively impacted you. Some of us may have blamed our mothers for leaving our, our fathers or blamed our mothers for being left by their deadbeats. And for you guys to say that being watching this channel is making you realize that there's so much more to this and making you want to go back to your mother and say, I'm sorry, or say, I love you, whatever. And making you have those conversations. I hope you guys are having those conversations with your mother. Mothers, I know it's difficult. That generation do not want to talk. <laughs> One thing about that generation, they will not talk. But... If watching me makes you understand your mother better, if watching me heals a little bit of part of you, if watching me makes you understand these conversations that you might never ever have with your mother, but also understand that which helps you um, understand yourself better also because I can imagine as a child, I don't know what it's like to have a deadbeat father, but I know what it's like to have a deadbeat baby daddy and i hope that you guys are easy on yourselves especially easier on your mothers they did go through a lot but even though you approach you see the thing is their generation the approach yeah but it's always just so it's questionable but sometimes it's best to once you understand them it's easier and i'm glad that this through this channel you guys are understanding your parents which means understanding yourself better which means being a bit easier on yourself being easier on your mother and just being kinder to yourself hope that you guys heal i wish you healing i wish you love and just know that you're not alone whether you were raised whether you had a deadbeat father or you have a deadbeat baby daddy you're not alone sasonke but we will we all come out on the other side god is not a fool and i, I don't wanna i'm under jake's on you guys i'm under jake's back but let me let me let me chill i promise people <laughs>
I only invited like two of my friends. One didn't confirm, one confirmed. So what I'm gonna do now is gonna go outside and go buy. I'm gonna go buy this meat, BRB. Um, I'm not gonna go do like a, a haul because they take forever like they make the video extra long and they're just unnecessary you guys would have seen in the, in the what is this in the shop what I, I picked up what I'm gonna do now is marinate the meat Lesejo and Rorisang Lucia's kids my friend Lucia's kids are coming I'm glad Lesejo's coming so he can help start the fire I'm just going to marinate the meat quickly and make chakalaka Let's cook! Congratulations for lighting a fire, city boy. Nana, can I have my dog costume? Hello, how are you? Good and you. 
Friday. I didn't want to vlog today because I felt like yesterday was a lot and I don't want this vlog to be too long. Some of you are complaining about my one hour vlogs, weekend vlogs. But I mean, let's say out of five people, only one person complained. So my weekend vlogs are still going to be an hour long and then the weekly vlogs are going to be between 20 minutes and 30 minutes. Um, if you don't want to watch an hour long vlog, I understand, but you can always drop off wherever you want. I do know that there are some of you guys who literally watch till the end because usually at the end, Diva Amanda cheeks and some of the comments say that you heard what I say, which means you watched till the end. So I'm not going to deprive the people who support my one hour long vlogs because of one or two people who complain about my vlogs being too long. As mentioned, you're more than welcome to drop off at 30 minutes or 20 minutes or however long, or you can just enjoy the ones I post during the week, which are usually about 20 to 30 minutes. So the reason why I had to uh, stop myself being I know I'm not going to record on Friday um, because I don't want the vlog to be too long. And I was just like, no, but my vlogs are long and I like that. And some of you guys like that too. So why not? So here I am on a Friday recording, which is going to make this vlog longer. <laughs> Because it's already going to be long. It's going to make it longer. Anyway, you guys, yesterday, Unol Tando and her sister and her son slept over. They just left now. Um, it's 10 o'clock. They just left now and they left with Milani. I'm just like, what do I do with all this freedom? What do I do without anyone nagging me? So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to make myself some coffee. Well, Alanda is going out with her friend. They're going out to the mall to go gallivant, I guess. I'm literally about to be alone. I don't know how long, because I told them, but the minute Milani starts being Milani, they must let me know so I can go fetch her. So I'm giving her an hour or two. And the nice thing about Unol's handle is that um, her son, Zan, is Milani's age. Well, he's two, she's three. Um, but they get along very well. They like the same toys they like. So I'm hoping, Guti, maybe an hour, she, she'll be able to do an hour without me. Um, then in that hour, I can do other things in the house, like clean. Speaking of cleaning, you guys. So, um... No kind of sister. Her name is Nantlantla. She's literally the most helpful person I know. Like, she will clean your house. So before, just before they left, she had already started cleaning and God bless her soul. But I was just like, you know what? She has given me inspiration to actually continue. Because as mentioned, I think I mentioned yesterday that I gave my helper a day off is all. She was supposed to come, but I was just like, you know, it's a public holiday. It's a long weekend. Enjoy it with your family. So... And she didn't come last week because she she had a family emergency. So almost two weeks now, I have had to clean my house by myself. And you guys always coming at me for my mopping skills. Guess what? Before she left, she put water. <laughs> she put water in a bucket <laughs> with soap and stuff. So I'm just going to pick up where she left off. And later on, I don't have any concrete plans for the weekend. Uh, a girl is not paid from my job from my freelance job not paid yet i'm hoping maybe zongena by the end of the day or maybe even tomorrow um but if i don't have if i'm not paid i can't have any plans i am just going to be chilling in the house with the kids later on my friend ayanda is coming she's going to be staying for a few days and i want to ask her if we can do a um a friendship tag because after uno after uno where I, I and I, I mean, 
I end up end up at two of my very, very, very best friends, actually. <laughs> so then it's a very, very close friends. They are those people. So I did that video with Nogwe and it was really, really nice. You guys liked it. And also that video also um, helped my, I don't, I don't want to say helped. It's just, you know, your friend loves you and you know how your friend feels about you. But when we do these videos, it's different because you really, really get to hear things that you wouldn't speak about. You wouldn't say on a normal day. So I want to ask her while she's here, maybe we'll shoot it tomorrow. If we can do a friendship tag, we've been friends for 10 years now. We made it work guys please give work people a chance obviously use discernment pray about it if you have to um just listen to your heart there are good people at work as mentioned before i think i've said this before with my friendships either i've met them online or i've met them at work Unogwe is the only person i made at school everyone else work and online so please give work people a chance um so i'm hoping she says yes to our friendship tag if she does say yes we'll shoot it tomorrow because she's only going to get here around four half past four and because it's winter the lighting is not going to be great so we, can, we can't shoot and outside that i really don't have any plans um my plans will change if i do get paid today maybe i'll take the kids out for lunch on sunday um we'll probably go to church on sunday if i'm paid we'll go to church on sunday if i'm not paid then i'll pray at home anyway let me make some coffee and let me clean the way that you guys will appreciate. Let me mop this house in a way that you will appreciate it. <laughs>done cleaning um with the help of big sis over there and i don't want to sound like a broken record today eh? but guys please friendships friendships when also i took milani this morning she was just like well milani was just like i want to go in the car with zani milani and zani are really really close um and they get along like they don't fight and one thing about milani milani does not like sharing or playing with other children but with zani she's always very accommodative and she shares with him and they they get along well so um this morning when Miltando was leaving she was like oh i want to go with zani and i was just like okay guys 
no sana just like put her in the cows of you and i'm just like okay i know milani milani can be a very very difficult she'll she's she's gonna cry and scream and it's just like as soon as that happens call me it's been probably an hour almost two hours probably and i haven't i keep checking my phone i keep checking whatsapp i don't have notifications on whatsapp so i have to physically go on whatsapp to check every second i've been on whatsapp there's nothing and i'm just like okay a milani not being here has given me an opportunity to actually clean the house. I was not going to clean the house if Milani was here. I was not going to do half of the things that I've just done if Milani was here. Because Milani, just like any other toddler, she's here, 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 here. And man, you go clean and you go shower more, yeah? And I didn't have to worry about anything. B, friendships, friendship, friendships. I couldn't have done this if it wasn't for a friend, you know? I think I mentioned this on my previous vlog. Nolan and I met online on Instagram, I think, and then she WhatsApp, and then she I don't know how when we exchanged numbers. Then we started talking late last year, only to find out that we're actually in the same industry. We know the same people. We've worked with the same people. Then we started talking gradually, and we became friends. Now I don't have a co-parent. You guys know this. I didn't realize how much I needed an hour away from Milani just to do just to be able to do things um literally she's only been gone for an hour but i'm less frustrated i'm calmer my house is clean all of that and all because moya has been cocky. yeah my moya has been cocky in coco moya basically and this wouldn't have been possible if i didn't make if i didn't answer a dm or if i didn't make friends i know that it's hard to make friendships as an adult but i feel like for, for moms especially at your child's school when you're dropping off your child at crash if you see someone that you'd like to be friends with just start greeting start talking to them make small talk um when you're picking them up when you have school concerts those things sit next to someone especially for us single moms sit next to someone who you see is also there alone chat up most of these crashes have whatsapp groups i know it's creepy but like take somebody if you see someone and then you can see their profile picture take their number and say hey girl we all want community and we all want friendships but it's just a matter of who approaches who so you never know how someone might react to you approaching them at the school just so saying hey you can start with something small as let's you know if you're ever free one of these days let's have a play date and a play date doesn't have to be at anybody's houses because we don't know each other and trust each other like that let's meet at Papachinos. let's go to the park we obviously live in the same area so like just try guys especially with the mummy ones you need a break you need a break and you don't know how willing people are like people are i'm always willing to give my friends a break um from their children and if i'm always willing it means they're also always willing it's just we need to just ask i'm going to make some food now i'm starving um i'm basically the nice thing about ibrai is that the following day oh um futumeso we pray i'm about to futumeso the shit out of this meat from yesterday let's eat So it is 12 o'clock and I'm going to go fetch Milani. Lointasha just called now saying Guti, she wants to bath her, so can I bring clothes? So I just figured ugh, after bathing, she can bath her in the meantime and then after bathing we'll come back. I think also Nami Sengi anxious um, and I think I will close today here because I'm literally coming back and we're not doing anything. I'm going to make sure that we're not doing anything for the rest of the day. I'm gonna chill. Hopefully, Milani passes out and takes a nap and alale, and so I can just chill and see. And then later on, my friend Ayanda is coming. Um, we're probably not gonna do it. We're just probably just gonna chill indoors, and then I'll see you guys tomorrow. I was just substitution
Bombastic side eye. Now, can I have a tip? What does that mean? Can I have a tip? Side eye. Side eye. Hey guys, oh, Alwanda is always teaching Milani these TikTok things. And she's always, literally. I'm seven. You're seven? Yeah. Okay. She's always teaching her these bombastic. I like my bombastic character. What's the other one? My name is Kutwa, no? No. no. What, was, what was say that? What was say is that? Yeah. Okay, what's the other one you guys like to say? Um, um, Ustaela. No. Well, what's that? It, it, they child you. To get to me. To get to me. How does it feel? Stella. Stella. <laughs> <laughs> Morning, guys. Um, we are done doing TikToks wow. with Milani. Happy Saturday. I want to say Saturday. This long weekend got me confused about the days. Happy Saturday. <laughs> My friend Tato oh got um, um, Milani this umbrella for her birthday, and I've been hiding it, and for some reason she found it, and I'm just like... Come again another day. Sister wants to play. Rain, rain, go away. Rain, 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 go away. By morning, guys. Uh, we just woke well, up. We haven't just woke up. We've taken a shower. Milan is dressed. I'm going to go downstairs. You wait. Because you wash your hair. I'm going to go downstairs and hang some laundry that I did last night. Make, make some breakfast. And my friend Ayanda is here. Me and her are going to share. Agree to shoot the friendship tag with me. So we're going to shoot that while the, the lighting and the sun is still nice and bright. But let's go make some porridge for this one. <laughs> a couple of hours since i was last here i ate and stuff yeah she's in the shower she's showering. yeah she's showering um and and i are ready to shoot i'm just making sure my wig is late ready to shoot our friendship tag here is yourself ready to shoot our friendship tag and then after that i am going to midrand to go see unati and tato have a quick date uh, afternoon date and ayanda is going on a date on her own 
and uh, yeah let's just let me prepare for our shoot you have your channel yeah look guys milani has a channel what's the name of your channel um my main Hey, my channel. It's K, my channel. I've been doing me like I got a blink check. I've been decking shade for the love and respect. Wanna touch these cross seas on me? No drama, more flights next year's looking lit. I'm laid up with somebody grass. I'm burning the gas to my last breath. Life is so fragile, enjoying the roses so high you can't see me. I'm seated. She wanna beat me, I'm trying to do Fiji. I live on the island alone. I'm trying to be one with my aura before I allow your soul. She want more than a flame. Want me to give her that moonlight. Everything not what it seems. Real one from the jump start. Gotta watch step on a tightrope. I never fall off this light work. Lord knows it's God's work. Hey you guys, um, we're done shooting the friendship tag. It was absolutely, absolutely amazing. Um, we are now, I'm just at a garage quickly pouring petrol. We are now on our way to Unati's house. Running a little bit late, but traveling with a toddler is a lot um let's go to Nancy's house you guys i just stopped at spa quickly to get milani her rice and bananas i don't even think i don't even know if i remember if i gave a context as to where i'm going i'm going to Nancy's house well i'll see when i'm editing this. i'll see when i'm editing this if i did give context but anyway um Unati and tato and i are meeting up um with just this thing of us only meeting up on special occasions needs to so we just randomly yesterday decided to meet up. So uh, yeah, I don't think I explained this earlier. So I'm going to go meet up with my mommy girls and we are running late. <laughs> but you know what? We're going to get there. Let's go. Wearing dresses, going all to different places, different planets. Uh, is this for me? Why? Are you good? Are you Sleep well. Mm -hmm. Okay. What do you want? You want? I want porridge and sinkwa. Porridge and sinkwa. Okay. 
Okay, mommy's gonna make your porridge and sink on it. You going back to sleep? Okay. Morning, guys. Happy Sunday. It was yesterday. I thought yesterday was Sunday. Can I say hi to the vlog? Hmm? Come. You want to say hi? I give you the phone, Good Mama. girl. Good girl. I thought yesterday was Sunday. And then this morning I wake I want up. I to talk to Mama. You want to talk to Mama? Then I wake up. Yo, his friends on the phone. Calls. Uh, and then... This morning I wake up and Alwanda is preparing for church. I'm just like, it's Sunday? It's only Sunday today? Anyway, happy Sunday. Wait, but Masha's going to answer me. There's mommy. Mommy, I want to talk to you. Oh, my love. Oh, I love to hear that. Be out of I'm happy to hear that. Talk to mommy now. You guys, um, I forgot to mention this when I woke up. Yes, guys, we have, we have kids. I can't do nothing. Nothing. Last time I'm just barging in. <laughs> anyway, yesterday when I was with Nati and Tato, Tato got me, me got Nati and I plants. Ne? But it's not just the plant that's important. She personalized these messages on our thingies that are also affirmations mine unati was one is different so she personalized it according to obviously our personalities and what we're going through i'm gonna fight on this girl i'm gonna fight on her because she likes being on my back anyway so she personalized it according to our personalities and the things that the struggles we've been facing lately and, 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 and mine says, Mandy, you are beautiful, you are loved, you are healing, be kind to yourself, Tato. I am going to have to keep this in the bathroom because it's an affirmation. Um, it's something that I would like to, I'm going to keep it like right here. I have to remove this tape. I'm going to just keep it like right here. This is my toothbrush set and stuff. So in the morning when I wake up, just something that I would like to read to myself and tell myself every day until I believe it, until it's stuck in my head. But like, this is a special thank you to Tato. But like, this is a special thank you to my friend Tato for this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Um, the plant is amazing, but the words are amazing, girl. Anyway, guys, so... Oh, Milani asked for porridge. Okay, she is budging again. She asked for porridge, so I'm going to go make her porridge. Who's that? It's you. And who? It's me. You see, mommy's going to hang these. So this is who? Milani. And? Uh, Amanda's hanging. And then this one? It's Wawa. And? Amanda. Yay! This one is a plant. It's a plant, right? Yeah. Yeah. This is Amanda and Milani. And yes. Wawa. It's Amanda and Milani. And Wawa. then let's see Amanda and Wawa. Well, it's here, and it's here. Yeah. Okay, I don't know how you found these, but let's make some porridge. You know the type, you know the guy. As soon as you're close to a race, all the lies get in much of mind. That's when he finds you. Don't take it.
shading from two to half past four. So I went to make, I'm not gonna make dinner now, but I just wanna make the preparations. Like I wanna make like biryani. Yeah. You wanna sit in the channel? So I'm going to, it's half past 12 now. I'm probably gonna do the actual cooking. And when it just comes back at half past four. So what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna make the salad and I'm gonna marry. <laughs> it's my channel. It's my channel. It's my channel. It's my channel. And I'm going to <laughs> marinate the meat. And I'll see you guys later. Say bye. Say bye. Bye. <laughs> Bye bye. I don't want to care so much. Cause I really care too much. It's all just overwhelming. I'm just overthinking. I feel like I'm too much. Keep mistaking my anxiety for intuition And stress keeps getting in the way of my ambition Logically, I know I shouldn't feel this way But my body doesn't agree with my brain I'm looking over my shoulder Worrying I'm coming here 
decided to close this long ass vlog. I just want to close it quickly before the lights go off. This wrong, mama. My sweetie pie here hasn't been feeling good. So we will close this little, our, I almost said this little vlog, this long ass vlog. And um, let me take care of her. She's been sick the entire weekend, shame. If you guys look at her right side of her face, you'll see that it's a bit bigger, it's a bit swollen. I don't know what's going on, so maybe tomorrow we'll go to the doctor. But um, let me, yeah, we don't want to go to the doctor. Okay, we won't go to the doctor. Let me take care of my little one. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.